The hijab has been worn in practice for centuries. Even before Islam, the women of the Abrahamic line would cover themselves with a veil and would act with respect and honor. In the 20th century, the media platform grew vigorously and was very accessible to people of all ages. Many Muslim girls began using this platform to talk about their religion and beliefs and try to make wearing the hijab in the West easier and more fashionable. However, the way the hijab was worn did not accommodate to the Islamic Sharia. And I think most people, when they think of hijab, they think of a head covering. Um, it's a lot more than that, obviously. It's the full covering of the body for a woman. Hijab became more of a fashion symbol, and the word modesty was used to define all actions. It's not this uh, idea from God himself that women are lesser than men, or from the Prophet even, that women were ever lesser than men. But in a physical way, we have varying responsibilities which come with the gender roles that are within this material realm that we live in. For young girls watching these YouTube influencers, they have a desire to be like them and to dress in a more fashionable way. In some cases, they would also feel pressured to look a certain way, to fit in and be more accepted. All of a sudden they have a platform saying, well, wow, this famous brand, let's say, has now introduced the hijab and it's been worn in a such a way, you know what, I might want to do that. That looks like something I would be willing to do. And then you have, on the flip side, you know, many influences that, you know, got famous, you know, by becoming a hijabi that, you know, does many things and there's many of them. And all of a sudden you'll, you'll find yourself, they follow them, they might not first necessarily have the right hijab. Women are commonly seen as flag bearers of Islam. They are constantly associated with Islam when seen on the streets because of their hijab. The hijab empowers women and gives them a sense of security and safety. Hijab should not be a factor that stops girls from achieving their goals and fulfilling their dreams. It should be a part of them and a part of who they are.